We have such complex um, issues in health and very little understanding sometimes of what works and doesn't work. Not just in terms of the clinical, technological aspects, but also the interaction of various issues, for example, social determinants of health from the social aspects. So it is trying to generate this field. And in addition to that, our um, part of the world, Zambia, Southern Africa, and developing countries in general, are even a little bit more behind the rest with health economics and public health issues sometimes in the context of the economics being new things. So that coupled with the, let's say, clinical side raises all these knowledge gaps which sort of make it mandatory that as long as you're in this field, research is not a luxury or an option we can afford. We've had all kind of biomedical, the, the, the clinical trials, studies around pediatric ARVs because that's a particular area that I've been involved in. And you recall the use of cotrimoxazole, both by WHO, developing it into treatment guideline, uh, guidelines across the world, came from um, the trials that were done in Zambia. Uh, the pediatric formulations of ARVs came from the clinical trials that were done in Zambia at the University Teaching Hospital. Right now we've had, I'm not sure, at least I was involved in this, I know there have been anti-TB drug trials as well at the University, of, uh, at the University Teaching Hospital School of Medicine in collaboration with, I uh, believe, South African and Ugandan institutions. Um, that have not followed up. But as I said, um, off the cuff, those would be some of the more immediate examples I can cite about research work and how it's been applied to influence the community. As you know, we had no pediatric formulations for, for ARV, ART um, until very recently. There seems to be one gap which, as I said, through discussion, we sort of reached consensus on, and that was setting out some specific tangible outputs, at least using the forum as an advocacy process or mechanism, setting out products and outputs that should be achievable. Something along what Honorable Minister said yesterday. I think that is uh, missing. What form and content, I guess that would be subject to bit. But we see, and the harmonization and coordination uh, along research work. And thirdly, the use of existing evidence and information to supplement continuing uh, research. I think these are the areas where it appears to be gaps and like to, to but it's, um, it's that forum which at least gives that positive um, um, value of the process that is there which needs to be added on.